Welcome back to the channel and thank you for joining me in another little episode here in Satisfactory guys. This will be episode 19 if I'm not mistaken. Let me take a peek just to be sure. Yes, this will be episode 19. Uh, today we're gonna take care of this stuff that's written in here and the right side. So I, want, I would like to be able to make computers heavy monitor frames. And of course, connect this production in here. Uh, I think it will be better just to start with this. Because if not, it's gonna be a mess. Uh, did I put that one? No. Yes, I did. Okay. H, three, four, five. In there. That's my next box. Uh, <coughs> Of course, didn't meant to do that. H. I'm gonna have to do this for all the boxes. And I think they're aligned. Amazing, isn't it? These boxes that you see here, they will all go away. Uh, I'm gonna take all the products that are inside of them and put them up top. I think I misplaced that one. One, two, three, four, five. No, it was fine. Okay. H. I won't take long. One more, and we are done with this. On this level at least. <laughs> now we gotta go up top. So in here I have 300 of those. Oh my god, in here I have a bunch. Well, let's just delete this line. And that line. So that we can connect our lifts. Uh, I don't understand why I have two lifts in here. Uh, maybe to transfer things faster. That one will have to go. Oh, I see what I did in there. Okay. Mark one. So take it from there. Put it in there. Like that. Of course, it's not right. Because this platform right here will have to go away. This, it's with this ugly stuff in here that I don't like. Uh, that will have to remain. But all of this will have to go away. That one is getting synced. Amazing. So, I want to bring down the products from here. I don't know if I want to bring them from this buffer or from the line. But I think they're from the line. Because, for example, if I take a million plates out of there, uh, we will. When, for example, we're going to go in there ish. Yeah, in there ish. Yeah right in there to make the aluminum factory if I empty that box of plates this box will get empty and that line will get empty so I would like to take them from here but this one gives me the overflow well this overflow will have to get down there somehow I don't know how yet but it's gonna have to be something like that uh as for the concrete well still have this box in the back filled up i'm thinking uh, yeah let's cut this one here oops wrong but this one normally shouldn't go up top because we have our production in here so maybe bring a line from the bottom of this box behind and plug it in there still we'll have to get rid of all that concrete let's see if our concrete up top it's filled up so it's going in there oh it's going straight in here so we don't have another buffer that's very good very very good let me get a sink uh or two just to make things move faster in here. Uh, we'll delete them 
afterwards, but for now, they'll have this thing here. Uh, Mark 3, Mark 4. One from there. One from there. It doesn't have to be pretty. Uh, yeah, you and you. Perfect. We will get rid of that box with everything that's inside of it. We'll connect that one to that one once we're gonna have enough space in here. Uh, I will not be able to get rid of that because way, way too many pipes in there. Uh, a lot of beams, a lot of encased beams. Let's deposit them in here. I think they stay in here. Yep. We'll keep 200 on me and that's it. So. I want those to connect on this level. That's the general idea. That means I'll have to come in here. Like that. And put those floor holes in here. So that one must go. That one and that one must go. This guy here, the floor hall. Do I have my light on? No, I do have it now. Perfect. You must go away, my friend. Uh, let's get rid of these guys. I don't want to send anything downstairs for now. So, there's the iron and these guys. Perfect. This just put them in here to know where the exit is for now. We'll have to bring them in here at some point. We'll see how we're gonna do that. But for now, we gotta delete everything that's in here. Just to beautify it a little, you know? Because I don't like all this stuff in here. Perfect, you can go away as well. I want to be careful not to delete something that's below us. That's a hidden talent of mine. Deleting stuff that doesn't have to be deleted. I think we're kind of cool in here. I think this one can go away as well. We might need it at some point, but not now. If it will be needed, We'll put it back. If not, it's gonna have to stay like that. So, we already agreed that concrete will not have an entry point up top. Um, let's connect all these lifts first. Because, if not, uh, when I connect them up top, they might have a reversed input, and I don't want that to happen. Still gonna have to get rid of all those pipes, but that is what it is. Maybe I'll sink them, and that's it. Let's see how many pipes do we have up top. So the steel is done in here. Oh, we got some space in there. And that was it for the space that we got in there, you know? These guys have filled up. Amazing. We'll just have to sink the rest, I guess. We'll keep two or three hundred for myself. But that box has to go. Uh, I think this one is sinking in here. So we're gonna take advantage of this box. Uh, I'll keep 600 for me. 800 a thousand okay let's do it your way now we were connecting these lifts apparently all of them are connected good stuff now we gotta transpose nice word isn't it 
This guy's up top in there. Light doesn't reach. Okay, let's get a little higher. What you doing, BAG? So one of them in there. The other one, it's in there like that. The next one, it's on the center. That one uh, on the edge. The other one on the other almost edge in here. That one is next to the center. So in there. That one is right between the floor pieces. This one, it's in here. Okay. Uh, yeah, it was good in there. Perfect. This one, it's straight in the middle. And this one, it's at the edge. Good stuff. Connect the lifts. I'm gonna put mark once. We'll upgrade them if needed. I don't think it's gonna be needed for this production that we got up top because we're not producing something like hundreds per hour per minute. But we'll see about that. For now, we'll just connect this, oops, amazing lift in here. And we'll see what goes where in a minute. Guess what? No more plates. Uh, not the concrete, the plates, please. Thank you. Good stuff. Now, let's see. Uh, we got in here the screws. These guys, I'm not sure I want to put them in here. I would like to get rid of that buffer that we have up top and send the 20, the excess of 20 in here because I never use screws. Uh, nevertheless, they are used in some stuff for example if i need to make computers like let's say we're going to make a field of generators fields we're gonna need the computers i don't have i'm missing like eight i'm gonna get a bunch of screws get on that crafting bench and make them manually so it is possible that i'm gonna pick from them but let's begin with these guys because they are kind of easy so plates rods screws Especially that we have them in here, you know. So. Down, please. Plate. Rod. Screw. Perfect. Got the plates in here. Got the rods in here. Got the screws in here. Uh, yeah. Well. Only when this box is gonna get full, which is never, because the excess is 20 per minute. So it's gonna take a sweet time filling this up. We're gonna have some screws going down there. I would like to get rid of this buffer. Nevertheless, the way it's sitting here uh, troubles me. Let's put it that way. I think because they're not aligned. You see, if I put a splitter in here, like normally, one of the belts will be crooked. Or if I put it in here, both of them will be crooked. So it ain't gonna look good no matter what I'm doing. 
Okay. Um. Hmm. So we get the rods in here. We got the plates in here, which are waiting basically. Uh, this one it's a Mark Four. Yeah, because we're making a bunch. So plates should be first. Rods should be the second one. And screws the third one. Yeah, let's bring them through here. Uh, we'll continue with the Mark Four trend in here. Just to keep death production going. I'll have to come in here somewhere. Want the good stuff. So that one has to become a mark for that one a mark for and the one below a mark for. Yep. Now we're gonna have our plates in there. Amazing. Let's do the same stuff for this rods. Of course, that one is not exactly well placed, so we're gonna put it uh, in here. Let's put one in here just to make sure it aligns with it. Something like that. Copy, paste, delete that one, delete that one, delete that one, it's a mark for it, right? It is. So you have the overflow, no it doesn't. I pasted the recipe for nothing. So in here I want the overflow to go to the left. Uh, we gotta make a jump. And then descend abruptly in here. Well, it is what it is. Good enough, I guess. I'm guessing that's the place. One, two. Yeah, it looks like that. So this lift is gonna have to become mark free as well. And the one below mark free as well. That guy. Good stuff. Uh, let's see. We have those. I wanna bring the screws in a similar fashion still not sure how to do this I think I'm gonna delete this that's it this buffer in here you know actually no let's 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 just leave it let's just leave it because there's no point in it deleting that one so <laughs> it's not even straight well in that case uh, let's grab everything we have in here. Deposit it in that box. Delete this one. Delete that one. Delete that one. And that tiny one in there. Delete this two. Perfect. And this one, please. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll come. I could bring a forward, but it's gonna look like shit. We're gonna have a normal speed. Uh, so it's gonna be in here. The belt will come. That's what I meant. Okay. I think it should be a Mark IV. And there it is. That one ain't gonna be straight, but it's fine. Uh, we established that this is our line. We'll put the overflow in there. Um, 
normally I'm gonna have only 20 overflow unless this box in here is getting filled up <sighs> but it's not gonna get filled up I don't think it's gonna get filled up am I missing any screws in that box down below Yeah. 500 like. Well, we can sink them. It is what it is. Let's delete that one. Uh bring a mark one belt in here. Uh let's keep it mark four. Better like that. Perfect. This lift mark four in here. Normally we, sh we shouldn't have anything on it right now. Good stuff. Uh, screws. I'm gonna put those in there. And those in there. You know. So now this production is done. We still have in here issues. This guys is filled up. Those guys are filled up. Those guys are filled up. So producing way more plates than we are using right now. So I would like to have the overflow over and overflow in here. Uh, saying ahead any to the right overflow because I want that production to keep moving I don't want everything to get stopped you know the miners those guys it should be filled up yeah exactly see no point in it so we're gonna put in here a special energy which is called sick uh, and I think I want to do the same for the other stuff but of course, this one is not well placed. We'll have to modify it. Just in case those lines are getting filled up, you know. So, we're gonna have another one in here. Let's call it... Well, this one is in here. Let's put it in here. Okay. And the next one, I'll put it in here. Just like that. Now... Oh, these are those 20 per minute that we already spoke about. Let's bring it from there. That's not well placed. Like that. So, mark 4. It's on the line. Perfect gonna have to get in front of it uh, this time we're gonna put the overflow in here just to make it a little more pretty Perfect. Uh, do I have place to put this one in here? Eh. Not quite. Well, I'm guessing I could. It's gonna have to be a mark three. Good. And this one's mark four. So pretty curious. Huh. 
how many sinks we're gonna need, you know? Well, it's gonna have to be like this because we'll sink only those, it's not the full production. So normally something like a Mark III should be fine. Of course, this guy's getting filled up in here. Those guys have filled up, filled up, filled up. Once those are empty, should be fine. So let's just put a merger, I don't know, somewhere in here. Yeah, something like that. Mark IV. This one is a Mark IV. We'll have to come on the other side. A little further, please. And the Mark III in here. All of them go into a sink. With the Mark V belt that we don't have. In case beams, please. Thank you. Good stuff. Now we'll be able to sink the excess. I don't like the way that lift stays in there. So let's try and rearrange it a little. Um, it's gonna be the same stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Well, can I make a belt jump over that belt? No, but I can make it jump in here. Ain't gonna be pretty. No, don't like it. Sorry. I think I lifted up twice. No, it was only once. Okay. That's more like it. Good stuff. I can sleep better now. Still looks like shit, but that's a totally different story, isn't it? Okay. Uh, we fixed those three. What's next in here? Uh, that was meant to happen, but it is fine. So reinforced plates, rollers. Now this is gonna get interesting in here. So, where are the reinforced plates in here? Yeah, these are the reinforced plates. Some of them are going in there. Some of them in here. How was that production? Uh, pretty stable. I think we were making something like 2.5 extra per minute because we are making 15. 7.5 consuming here and we're consuming something like 5 in here exactly so we have an excess of 2.5 that means I'll have to plug in there one of those beauties it's gonna be tight uh, overflow to my left and we're gonna pick that one and we're gonna come around with them on the other side, perfect. So overflow left, perfect. Uh, mark one, of course. Don't need more than that. Jump over that. We're gonna have the overflow from here. Actually, this box will go away. Uh, can I make this one go away? That's what I want to know, because no need to have another one. I think I can. Again, we'll sink a bunch of those. Uh, do I have place downstairs to put them? I think so, because I picked a bunch of them. 
let's see. Yep, yeah, guess what? I had some space in there. How about the rotors? Uh, enough space. So, deploy this box in here. Put all those in there. Grab them all. Put them in there. Keep a hundred of them in for the belts. Delete that. Mm, delete that. Delete that. Delete that. Uh, give me the smart splitter, please. Thank you. In here. Uh, wrong orientation, BG. Smart. Perfect. So, this one, it's a mark one. In here, in there, and in there. Amazing. So, we're gonna have any, any, an overflow to our left. Perfect. This one will be the exit. Um, give me all those. Go away. Thank you very much. Let's put those rotors down. My space? No. Perfect. Uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Still have 300 on me. But it's fine. So, mark one for each. If I come with them through here, it's gonna be a bloody mess, so I'm gonna have to come with them through here. Uh, mark one. First and second. Perfect. This one will have to be like that. These are my reinforced blades. And these guys are the rollers. A thing like this. Amazing. I don't see if it's aligned or not. Now it is. Okay, so <laughs> that thing gets in the way. Um, it comes fairly straight from there, with that joke. Yeah, we'll have to push it a little to the left and bring it through here. And this guy will connect it straight into the splitter in here. So this boy will have to go away. We'll just place it in here. Put that mark for inside of it. If we can. Perfect. Got some power in here. Well, we should have some power here. We do now. So, first one, in here, we're gonna have the reinforced. And this guy, it's with the rotors. Let's take care of the rotors first. Because it's easier. All I gotta do is align that smart split with this one. So in theory it should be simple. Perfect. So ahead, any to the left overflow please. Put them in there. Okay. Um, hmm. You can take this. Thank you very much. Just release them. Let them be. It will fill that lift. This one's gonna have to come to the lift of that guy. So let's just turn it a little. A little more, maybe. On that line.
It wasn't exactly on that line. Okay, let's bring a phone there in that case. If I put a lift on it in here, it's gonna look that bad. Oh, I don't think so. I think it's gonna be cool. If I cover it closer, it's gonna look bad. Um, yeah, it's not good. It ain't good. You know why, right? Overflow of the overflow gotta be synced. So, right now, we're pushing them in there, pushing them in the box. They're gonna have to be synced. This guy here is pushing them into the box. That box is already filled up. So, they need to get synced. When uh, I will pick this line, it's gonna look like shit, you know. See, I mean, it's kind of good for this line, but it's not good for the other line. So we'll have to delete them, uh, both of them. No other way. Gotta be a line in here. Uh, I don't want to make a million curves with them. So it's better just to delete everything and put it straight where it should be. I mean, not straight. Okay, so let's bring this one. This is reinforced plates, right? Is it straight? Good stuff. We'll lift it up in here. Drop it down in here. Uh, yeah, I think it's gonna be fine. Come with me. In here. So we're gonna have a head any to the left overflow. It's gonna be just fine. This is my line for the reinforced plates. Bingo. Now, uh, next to it, I want another line in here, uh, which will give me access to this merger. So in here, I want that spar splitter that will do the same thing with these guys that one has to be aligned with that sending here ahead any to the left overflow in here is gonna be the same ahead any to the left overflow that way our rotors will go into the box overflow getting in there getting synced And they are straight as well. What do you know? We made this one as well. Good stuff. Uh, I think I still have those on me. Very nice number in there, if you ask me. Uh, these are the reinforced plates. Well, uh, how are you guys? A hundred. The other one is filled up for sure. Let's put some in here. Oh, I cannot split them. Okay, well, in that case, I'll wait for him to build. And put in here 500. He will release them. We will not build anything on that line for a few minutes, but it's fine. It will fill this belt up. It will fill that box up. It's gonna be just amazing. 
I think the box down here is filled uh, in there. Yep. This one is filled as well. Perfect. We're going to have to do the same stuff for the modular frames. I think they're done up here. And then the rest of these guys are done in there. Except for the plastic and rubber, which are that away. So let's take care of the next one, which is the modular frames. Uh, why is... Okay, good stuff. So modular frames is the next box, I think. This one, yep. Well, that one, we're gonna need a bunch of them. I don't wanna sink them. I don't wanna sink those unless I have no other choice. So I'm gonna come with it next to this guy here. This one it's fake. It shouldn't be here. We're gonna do like this. Align it with that one. Perfect. Uh how many? <laughs> Five per minute. Okay. A mark one should be more than enough in here. Uh, this one, I still had some plates in it. Perfect. Those plates will fill that belt, that elevator. You still have some, baby? You still have some. Uh, you get 50. You get 50, wherever they are. In here. Perfect. Uh, you can get this as well. Oh my god. Okay. Take those. Okay. Delete those in that case. Perfect. So this one is going to get filled up with those amazing beams. Okay. Uh, not beams. Mario frames. Ever. We hope. We don't know if it's going to get filled up or not. Mm hmm okay the box downstairs I think is kind of empty so um, I'll leave myself a little more space in here exactly Good stuff. Uh, I have 35 for me, no point in depositing them in there. Uh, this guy is still trying to push all those plates out. I think it will help if I make that one a mark too. Uh, this one should be the first to become a Mark V in here. But, see, normally, we'll put something like 20 screws per minute, maybe. Uh, overflow, please. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's filled up now, but it's only 20 per minute. Plus the excess of those. So, for the time being, it's going to be fine. We also gonna have something like one rotor per minute in 2.5 plates, reinforced plates per minute getting synced. Making a bunch of coupons in here. It's good. It's very good. We can buy stuff with them. Why don't you be? Okay, let's take care of the next issue. Uh, what is this? Steel. All three of them. Okay. So we get the pipes. We get the beams. And we get those. Oh, 
looks pretty clear. Sure here, what don't you agree? I think so. We got it here. The beams. We got it here. The pipes. Oh, we got it here. The case beams. Um. Let's. So they're gonna have to come that way. Okay. Do I need an extra storage? I don't think so. And for this one, for sure. But for these guys, I don't think so. We're gonna end up building a lot more than this, so... Don't care about it. Where is that one going? That's what I wanna know. Where is that one going? Uh, all the way in there. Oh, we're making the status one. Methinks. Yeah, indeed. Hmm, very good. Very, very good. Let's bring them up to their respective boxes. We already established it's going to be that way. So, hmm, this is going to be interesting. Because I want them through here. And then in there, you know. Okay, so we get the beams first. Mark one for all of them. We'll see after that what's going on. there so we plugged in the beams uh, only three are producing in here. We're making 45 per minute. So, that belt is going to be more than enough. When that one is going to get filled up, this one is going to get filled up, and nothing else will happen. No sinking for now. Let's take care of these amazing pipes in here. I want to put it in here. Now, pipes, we're doing quite a bunch. As you can see, these guys are getting filled up. Those are filled, these are filled. This, not yet. But they're gonna be filled up pretty soon. Uh, it's a Mark III belt, so why is the Mark III? I don't know. Uh, we're making 40, 80, let's say 120. Mark this should have been enough. It's a Mark III, okay? It is a Mark III. Oh yeah, I remember why it's. I said that. If we have some more production, I'm going to put it in that box. That's why. It's fine. We're going to make this one mark free. Do I have enough of those? Uh, let's grab a little more. Now for sure I have enough. And bring that mark free belt in here. And next to this one, but not touching that. In here. Okay. Um, so this is a smart splitter here, right? No, it's it's a normal splitter. Perfect. Gonna put the smart splitter in here. Uh, say, give me the overflow to the left, please. Thank you very much. Uh, Mark me about. Let's bring it. Doesn't even matter. Let's bring it through here. That one is not aligned with anything, of course. So let's align it with something in here. 
Perfect. That way I'll be able to put this belt kind of straight. No? We got the pipes in. Now it's time to take this in case pipes and put them in there. Uh, just gonna move this box in here. And I would like to be double box, you know. Because, uh, yeah. Let's have two mark two belts on it. gonna go with them um, that way let's bring out from the other side Looking just amazing, but not sure. No. It's not looking amazing. Now it's looking amazing. Straight like that. Perfect. We get the encased beams in. Uh, this one will have to become a mark too, of course. These two guys can go away. For now. They will be needed later, but not for now. Perfect. What's next? Plastic rubber and those magicas. Wow. Oh, this is gonna be really something else. Uh, we're sinking all plastic and all the rubber at this point in there so I don't know how to bring them it's in here you know issue is <laughs> they're not separated so I should separate them yeah first and bring them in I'm thinking through here jump on these lines if possible what is that one? mark two mark three let's say mark three for both of them let's take that mark three belt I'm gonna have to fill this space of course And bring up in here next to these guys, you know, if possible. Okay, both of them will have to be marked free, that's for sure. Got him. Um, let's keep it up. Okay. 
And I think they kind of close, but... I don't remember which one is which. Uh, the second one is rubber. So this one is rubber. That guy is plastic. Missing iron rods. Amazing. Not anymore. Good stuff. So in here, I'm going to have to have the smart splitter. Yes. Uh, one for plastic, one for rubber. So in here. And maybe here is gonna be on that line perfect yeah it's gonna be just fine uh first things first nevertheless gonna have to separate these boys so how is this one done here i see let's take care of separating them first gonna need to have in here two smart splitters one in here and one up top same like this. Uh, well, let's connect them first. Let's see. Uh, wait. Up top. Uh, the first one is rubber. So let's put down the rubber. Doesn't matter. Up top, we're gonna put the plastic here. Plastic. And to the left. The rubber okay ahead plastic then rubber no ahead plastic to the left rubber let's see what have we done here uh merger please No, they're not aligned. Amazing. So the plastic should come through there. Uh, what the hell am I doing? Well, actually, it was good. Well placed, I mean. But the execution was bad, you know? So, rubber is going to my left. Well, let's put in that case rubber hand. And plastic. Uh, to the right. Plastic, please. Come on. What you doing? Why not? Take. Enter. In here, I want none. Well, something is wrong with this splitter. So, in here we have the rubber to the left. Gonna put him in there. Uh, and in here, we should have the rubber head. This one should be none. And the plastic to the, to the right. So, in here we got the rubber and the plastic to the right so this one will have to go up top now uh, this one it's the rubber in here sorry about that so we're gonna have a smart splitter in here with the mark free lift saying ahead and into the right uh no ahead overflow 
to the right any okay and this will be our rubber in here which should start flowing basically uh no because it's blocked by the plastic okay uh for the plastic it's gonna have to be in here uh no a little more to the left to the right in here okay come on it's gonna say to the right any a head overflow okay and our overflow will be in here basically you know this one it's overflow because that guy ain't connected yet with that guy it just happened so we will have our plastic and our rubber in there that one is barely moving i don't know why oh i know why we're producing way too much uh this guy and this guy are gonna have to be marked for uh i don't have pinky spinners okay already one hour into the recording time unbelievable time passes so fast when you're having a good time with a game like this wonderful game man so is that one mark for it is that one is a mark for uh good stuff that one it's a mark for this one has to become a mark uh, that one is a mark for perfect perfect those boxes are filled up so it's all gonna get synced you know Again? Unbelievable. You know, it's kind of slowed down in there. I don't know why. Of course, that one is marked for something. <laughs> B.A.G. In action, in here. Well, it looks like it's working fine now. Not exactly fine in there, but... As soon as that line down there is gonna get declugged, it's gonna work better. Remember, it worked fine like this. Uh, without having a second singer here, so the one below it's empty, as you can see. We're sending rubber in there, uh, they stick clogged the lines, okay. But they're gonna get declogged right about there, only the time that it took for us to disconnect them. It's gonna be fine. It's working just fine. Amazing. Well, we only pushing like 200 and 200. So 400 products. Uh, each one of those belts is 200. They're capable to 70. It's going to be just fine. Now, the only thing that we're missing here are the stators, which should come in here uh, from that box. Honestly, I'm not even sure I want to bring them down. Honestly. So, I don't even know if I should bring them down. 
So we're consuming four per minute. I think we're making eight per minute. Yeah. I'm not even sure I want to bring them down. Let's bring them nevertheless. We are here. So. At least we'll know that we're finished with this stuff, right? Mm, mark one, please. To the right, any to the left, up. I think it's too close, yeah. Good stuff. Uh, now this box will get empty, of course. Will help it. Don't have the inventory space, but it is what it is. Gonna have a few roads to make in here. Uh, at least we'll bring these suckers down. Got a bunch of pipes in my inventory. I'm not sure, but I think I wanna sink some. So, let's get rid of them. Also, these guys, way too many. Uh, how many pipes am I left with? Let's keep 600 on us. These guys are way too many. 400 will be enough. Those guys are fine. Don't need the plastic and the rubber on me, thank you. Don't need the silica. Perfect. They're gonna get synced, like, really fast. Um... This one has become obsolete in here. I don't even remember what used to be here. Oh, the air limiters. Okay. Goodbye. Well, actually. Well, actually. No. Just leave that box. Because once ours is getting filled up, they're gonna have to live in here. Good. Uh, this one in exchange will become obsolete yeah because we're putting the overflow in our box down below so it's gonna be just fine you can grab those as well have fun with them don't care about it well i think that this concludes our connect production the magic in here uh, let's wait for this one to finish and finish connecting the production basically because we're still missing a thingy in here I'm gonna put a mark 4 belt belt I said from here to that concrete Uh, 
And now, for real, we connected all the production. We still need to make computers and heavy Mario frames and God knows what else, but at least everything is connected right now. Everything is nice and dandy. Me loves it. I like it. It's beautiful. Looking just amazing up here. <laughs> Gotta love it. Gotta love it, I'm telling you. So, that's... Uh, yeah. That one doesn't come very well in there. Because if I'm gonna have that one in there, for example, and the lift in there, oh no, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It doesn't interfere with the operation. It's gonna be fine. Perfect. Don't have to modify it. I could pull it to the left a tiny bit, but it's not needed. So, I guess that into the next one, we're gonna take care of those computers and we're gonna see exactly from where we can pick stuff to make the heavies I mean things is gonna be happening here because it takes normal Mario frames and I don't remember what else heavies we got a bunch of recipes in here pipes mm-hmm we can make it without pipes. We can make it with what we have in here. Uh, I mean, look, this recipe, if I add it in here, it's modular frames. Let's put it like this so that we can see it. Modular frames. Got them right in here. Okay. Encased industrial beams. Those are far away in another galaxy in there. It doesn't matter. Steel pipes. They are always in another galaxy in there. And concrete. Well, the concrete, I think it's always in here. Because it comes for the encased beams straight on this lift in here. So, basically, three of the four elements are in here. Encased beams, right in here. Steel pipes, right in here. Uh, concrete, right in here. Is that guy coming from below so we could put the splitter on that and bring it whatever we want this one in here we'll say <sighs> I didn't put it right right yeah we'll say over flat in here fill up the box okay Fill up the box. Well, in that case, this one can be a simple splitter. Perfect. I can have those pipes are going towards our box, by the way. Uh, we can have the others exiting through here. Amazing. We can have the concrete from there. Let's just bring them up in the front so that we know what we gotta do in the next one because somebody's gonna forget we got encased I can bring it from there just like this perfect because the one below it's empty we got a bunch in here uh, let's bring it in a more beautiful way maybe uh, yep like that To that one, a mark to put a mark to belt in here. We got the encased beams. Uh, we got on a mark three. These guys, we will need the concrete, take it from below. I think it passes right through here, so it ain't gonna be an issue. Exactly, we can make the same thing as there. And all that we're missing is those modular frames from there. Uh, from here they're coming into this line in here and then in here put split them in here put a splitter in here and send them exactly in there and I think that's exactly what we're gonna do uh, I think it will be just fine I mean instead of dragging that belt 
I could put it underneath as well. Uh, from here up to there in a funky little way here. Ain't it possible, okay? So grab it from here. Go all around with it. Totally feasible. It's going to be just fine. Bring it through here. Turn it in here. Bring it in here. Yeah, I think that's going to be better than splitting this output in here. Because after that, it's going to be too crowded. Splitting it in here. Bring a belt. I don't know where between these guys and bring it in here. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I'll think about it. In the meantime, this episode is very long. You'll have to excuse me for that. At least we can check in here that I did. We did the connect production. So one of my tasks is done. I don't know about yours, but one of mine is none. And to the next one, we'll take care of those heavies. We'll see how many we can do. And um, the computers, of course. And that will make us um, exactly where we were before deleting our factory. Actually, from better, I may say. Because instead of having a million floors in there, now everything is visible. We can see and modify everything as we want. Upgrade the addresses fit. We still have a lot of space to expand in here without any issues. We're sinking everything that we're not using, which is just amazing. If you ask me, perfect. Yep, I kind of like it. We still have a build of that copper that is not used, a build of coal that is not used. I think I want to put down some explosives in here, start making some gunpowder. So maybe I'll bring that sulfur in here. I don't know, still thinking about it. But uh, I think we're sitting pretty good. We are sitting pretty good in here. Guys, we're gonna leave this episode in here. Thank you very much for being here, for watching this. If you like it, don't forget to put a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't, if you wanna see more. If by any chance you wanna help me on my trip of becoming a full-time content creator, you can do that by grabbing yourselves an amazing membership. Thank you again. I'll see you in the next one. Bye now.